All right, time to open up the P.O. Box mail I got in November. Let's see what you guys sent in. First off, we have a letter from Arkansas. Hello, Sung One. Hope all is well. I just wanted to write and tell you how much I appreciate your channel. My mom and I are in quarantine again, and I've been binge-watching your videos. I've been subbed for about two years now, and you never fail to make me laugh. Hope you stay safe, and happy Thanksgiving. Jacob. Thank you very much, Jacob. They sent uh, this Umbreon. Hey, thank you very much. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Here's a letter from Swan from Texas. How's it going, Sung One? I must say it was real sweet of you to cut your hair like that. I don't know if I could ever do that. Kudos to you. Have you ever tried doing a Trying Flavors of Doritos video? I have, actually. It's, uh, yeah, it's on my food playlist. Go ahead and check that out. I tried 12 of them. I think it would be great for you. I wish you a happy Thanksgiving during these hard times. I am thankful that you provide us with amusing content. Here are some Yu-Gi-Oh cards for your pleasure. Stay awesome, Swan. And they sent, uh... Endless Decay, and then Dark Magician. Ooh, thank you very much. Really appreciate it. Here's a letter from Adnan from California. I like this card. Dear Sung One, been a fan of your work since the Vine days. God, I miss Vine. Love the consistent, hilarious content you put out and wanted to send you this in appreciation. I myself have been following my dreams and I'm involved in professional wrestling and have been the last three years. Notable voice actor Kyle Hebert frequently comes out to our weird comedy wrestling show in Burbank called Wrestling Pro Wrestling, or WPW for short. If you're interested in a fun, entertaining time, I'll invite you to come out to it as soon as the pandemic settles and we can have fans again. Stay healthy this holiday. Professional wrestling ring announcer, commentator, manager, and referee uh, Adnan Qureshi at The Dashing Adnan. Adnan? Sorry if I pronounced your name wrong. That, that is awesome, Adnan. Um... I hope you dress up as Luigi, but even if you don't, uh, that's really cool. That sounds like a lot of fun. I, I, if you're, if you guys are near Burbank, you want to go check that out. Wrestling Pro Wrestling. That sounds fun. Here's a letter from New York, and uh, it's me. Wow. Thank you very much. Here's a letter from Landon from North Carolina. Hey, someone. How was your month? My name is Landon. I have been a big fan since June 2014. I initially found your channel when watching a Caleb City video, and have enjoyed your content since. My favorite video is when you skip all the cutscenes to get to the gameplay because it's funny and accurate. I really have nothing else, uh, to say except keep up the good work. Enjoy the month of December and happy holidays. May 2021 be a good year. God, I hope so. Keep it up, Landon. Thank you very much, Landon. Uh, my month was pretty good, actually, uh, considering COVID and everything. But, you know, I kept inside, kept safe, and we had a good Thanksgiving, so it was good. So thank you very much for the letter. Here's a letter from Jessica from Ohio. Hello! It's always nice to see a One Piece fan. That's fun. Thank you for making such great videos. I love the variety you have on your channel and your easygoing vibe through it all. I hope you and your friends and family are surviving this strange year. You are a bright spot in your viewers' day, so I can only wish for you bright spots of your own. If you're interested in a daily chuckle, I run a wholesome little webcomic called No Pizza After Midnight. I've kept it up six, com six comics a week for over seven years now, and I'm very proud of it. I'd be honored if you checked it out. Last thing, every time I watch your P.O. Box videos, I spend the whole time trying to get a look at whatever cool shirt you're wearing. The camera's just high enough that I can't see. Please show us your t-shirt. Thanks. Have a nice day. Happy Thanksgiving, Jessica. And they drew some great drawings throughout as well. I am wearing a Star Drop Saloon shirt uh, from Star Dew Valley. Uh, I'm glad I'm wearing a cool shirt today. Um... But yeah, thank you very much, uh, Jessica. If you want to check out their webcomic, that is No Pizza After Midnight. Go check them out. Thank you very much, and thank you very much for the cool drawings. All right, here's a letter from New York. Dear Mr. Cho, I hope this letter finds you well. I'm writing to express my absolute favorite moment in a video of yours. Specifically, it's when you're told to change the article title to You Won't Believe, and you respond with a totally convincing You Won't Believe? That's got the perfect combination of disbelief and barely repressed intensity. You may also notice this letter is scented with frankincense and myrrh. This is an accident. I dropped my typewriter into mother's vat of tree resins, and now she's very cross with me. I tried to clean it off, but the keys still imprint the scent into everything I type, you see. Or rather, you smell. Well, that's all for now. Stay well, and I have a look of for and I have a look forward to seeing more from you soon. Sincerely, L. Dolphin, the sewers under Manhattan. P.S. If you're ever in New York City, call me up and drinks are on me. I don't have a phone, so simply knock loudly on my door and I will look through the peephole and see you and then grab my hat and coat and gloves if it is winter and fill my wallet with quarters so I can buy you whatever you like. Well, all I expect from people is lots of gumballs, so that's perfect. Thank you very much, L. Thank you very much for the letter. And here's another letter. Ooh. 
Hi Songwon, I hope you are doing well. I love watching your videos, they always cheer me up and I always quote them daily. Keep being you and thank you for making such great content. Here's some stickers I made, I hope you like them. Ooh, and this is at adequate underscore drawings. Uh, some cute legendary dogs here. Chuckles, we got this Kirby, and then we have some hands, yeah. At adequate underscore drawings. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Here is a package from Steve from New York. Hmm. Sung Won, hi again. Last year I sent you some gem blunders, prototypes, and a custom hero card. Thanks so much for sharing them on your channel. Thanks to your help and many others, we successfully funded our Kickstarter and completed our first print run of gem blunders. I wanted to follow up and show you the final game. We are so excited to continue to grow the community. We hope you get a chance to check it out. All the rules in our online shop are at gemblenders.com. Have fun gem blending. Sincerely, Steve. Hey, that's great to hear. Congratulations. And they sent me a copy of Gem Blenders. If you guys want to check out Gem Blenders, that's gemblenders.com. But congratulations. Uh, fulfilling a Kickstarter is no small feat. So uh, that's awesome. Here's a package from Wesley from Idaho. Dear Sung Won, I've been following you for almost three years now. In that time, I've become one of my favorite YouTubers. I love your comedy sketches and Let's Try videos, and I think you're a very talented voice actor. My favorite role of yours is Hyoto from Agretzuko. Included with this letter is a selection of merchandise for my favorite anime film of all time, Arashi no Yoruni, which translates to One Stormy Night in English. This year marks the film's 15th anniversary, and while it's never been released in the United States, there is an English dub that can be found online. The merchandise consists of two plushies with the main wolf character, Gabu, and two keychains that have Gabu charms on them. I've also included some additional things that aren't related to Arashi no Yoruni, but came with the merchandise when I initially bought it, such as a pink chick, a card with ancient Japanese artwork, and some Pokemon Sun and Moon thing that I think might be tissues. If you haven't seen Arashi no Yoruni before, you should totally check it out. Here's to hoping the film eventually gets an American release, preferably with a second English dub that has you as one of the voice actors. Hey, that'd be cool. Sincerely, Wesley. I am familiar with- I know this movie. I have friends who really like this movie, actually. Uh, let's take a look. Isn't this the one with, like, the wolf and the sheep? Yeah, or the lamb? That's right. Yeah, I, I have- wow, yeah. I know- I have friends who used to have icons of these back in the day. Like, live journal icons of these characters. Wow. Here's another one where he's, uh, not- uh, got his mouth open. Oh, yeah, here are some of the keychains. Very cool. And then we have this. Some of those tissues. And this little trick. Thank you very much, Wesley. Yeah, I mean, listen, if they ever dubbed it and got me, that'd be pretty cool. So, yeah, thanks for the letter. Thanks for all the stuff. I really appreciate it. And finally, we have a very big box here from Joshua from Ohio. Oh, wow. To talented snack connoisseur, board game professor, Pokemon master, Sung Won. From an Ohioan, Joshua Carson. Hello, Sung Won. I've been a fan for quite some time. Your work as a voice actor like in Tuka and Birdie, your acting in Anime Crimes Division, or your comedy skits on Vine and YouTube have given me hours of comedy and laughs. So I thought you being my first letter I've sent to an influencer slash voice actor slash comedy slash celebrity just made sense. During 2020 things, like they have been for a lot of people, has been difficult. But having Press Buttons and Talk, a hilarious video game channel with Alex and sometimes Anne Marie that everyone should subscribe to, link in the description below, uh, and your board games review always gets me in a better mood. So with Law of Equivalent Exchange, I thought this is something you could enjoy. It's fairly new, and if it skips, just put a few heavy coins on the needle. I've also included a pic of my two cats. We've got uh, Olive and Gravy. Aww. Look at those two. I hope you, one, could read my handwriting, and two, continue to live your life to the fullest. Plus Ultra, your lifelong fan, Joshua. Thank you so much, Joshua. Now, Joshua sent me... This is a turntable record player, I believe. This is... Wow. Uh, I assume this is in response to because somebody sent me a vinyl record. Well, this is very cool. Thank you very much. Uh... Very generous of you. I was not expecting that. Well, thank you very much, Joshua. And uh, your cats are very cute. All right, that was all the mail for this month. Uh, thank you very much to all of you for your letters and gifts. Let's uh, stay at home, keep safe, uh, and um, you know, hopefully uh, this next month of 2020 won't be as bad as the previous months. You know, just keep safe out there. All right, peace.